This man is insane. Oh, security. Yo, Taylor, you ever been escorted out by a security guard at the mall? What's up, guys? Welcome back to another vlog. If you are new here, my name is Tanner Fox. This is my house. That's my dog right there. And this is the new merch that just came out, guys. I have been getting so many new subscribers lately. It's awesome. So much growth, so much support from you guys. If you guys are new here, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by, watching my vids. And if you're if you're old here and if you've been you've been watching videos, I still love you just as much. Probably a little more. I don't know, I should probably stop talking, I don't even know what I'm saying. This new merch is out for six more days, guys. Go cop this new hat, this new shirt. We got that new backpack. So on today's agenda, we are headed up to Phase Rugs. Well, actually first, we gotta go to the Apple Store to get a few technical um, items for, for a computer. And then we are headed up to Phase Rugs' house, and I finally get to give him this. In this new T-Fox little drawstring backpack, let me show you what I got in here. So if you guys saw my video a few days ago, me and Rug had a, a supercar street race, my GTR versus his Huracan. And I decided that it was a good idea to, to bet $10,000. So I thought it would be fun to pay him in 20s, so I went to the bank and uh, I'm about to lose $10,000. That's fun, that's always a good day. And so we're headed up to Faze Rug's house, hopefully gonna pay him all of these. Uh, this is like, they're all 2,000. And I'm, by the way guys, I'm in no way trying to flex this on you all. It's just, uh, this is how I'm paying him. So this is, really isn't even my money. If anything, if Rug wants to flex it, he can, but yeah, that's what I'm giving to Rug today. Guys, I got it in the bag. The money is in the bag. And I got him the new t-shirt, and I'm gonna give him a new hat, and I'm gonna give him the bag, just to hook him up a little bit, you feel me? Sorry that you have to Just a cold summer day, not a peep in sight. My ears hurt. All right guys, it's an errand type of day. We gotta go to this Apple store and get a charger and then walk around here for a little bit, do a few things, and then we're headed up to Face Rug's house. <laughs> let me see this, let me see this, let me see this. On the new MacBook, they decided that it was a good idea to take out the US, or the, so they can the charge SD card. Up $150 to they're use smart, the they're card. smart. Apple keeps taking out things that we need so that we have to buy more things. Okay guys, so I drove like 30 minutes north to Face Rug, like I'm like pretty close to Face Rug's house because I got his freaking money. Sitting here with merch for him and he's not answering the phone. So I don't know what to do with it We have to go up to Temecula because we have a super busy day planned, but bro rug You're literally not answering. I have 10 grand and designer clothing to give you and you're not answering the phone So uh, we're gonna wait around here for like maybe the next 15 minutes And then we really have to go up to Temecula and then I'll figure out something else fun to do with this rug And then sorry, man, you're gonna you're losing out on 10 grand It's way too much to be carrying around on me and it, I, it's it's rightfully yours But I'm not keeping this on me for much longer. So hopefully you answer the phone. I got a real-life follower He's done this like 15 times now. He keeps oh, getting I'm in a bad spot. I'm in the dead spot. Oh, He's gonna passing. pass you. He's gonna pass you. Oh, bro, you're my follower. There he is. He's my man. Why? He's like a little brother. There he goes. There he goes. He's a real life follower. Alrighty, we are back in Temecula, guys. We're at Dylan's house. Yay! <laughs> Luna! <laughs> This is my dog. This is my dog. I don't care what Dylan says. I don't know. Dylan's recording music or something, but, but I'm about to take his dog, guys. I should do a stolen, pr a stolen dog. Pr yeah, this is Linda. I renamed I her. Hi, Linda. All right, you ready, Brad? Let's go. So I had this huge day planned to go give Rug his money, but he's not answering me. So we ended up coming up to Temecula just to hang out. And Chris, what is this contraption you have over there behind that truck? It's a law Ferrari. Okay, okay. Chris is just a savage, and I was looking out here. I was sitting on, like, the little furniture right there. And I look around this truck and I was like, is that, a, is that a Lambo? And I was like, wait, don't you have a Lambo? And then I went up there and I was like, hey, isn't that your Lambo? And sure enough, it is, it is. So if you guys didn't know, Chris is an absolute savage and this is his Gallardo. So he's gonna take me for a ride in it, guys. I don't know how, I really don't know how I'm around supercars all the time. Like I drove a McLaren yesterday randomly. Um, like there's, I don't know, but I just came. All right, let's go. I thought it was white. I didn't realize it was silver. Oh. They're kind of cute together. They really are. They're kind of cute. Okay, so this is my first time in a stock Gallardo. All right, we're gonna get the full experience with Chris. I like the paddles. They're so like little. <laughs> the twin turbo it has way more power than I thought it would really yeah okay okay Gardo. <laughs> all right not bad the shifts are so nice I know Dude, the shifts feel so good guys the difference between one of these correct me if I'm wrong these have one clutch new huracans have dual clutch so right. the shifts on this are like you can really feel them In a Huracan, if you're shifting, it's it's like instant. It's like my GTR. Like you can't even feel the shift. 
this, it just it just kicks you right back in your seat again. Damn, yeah, we're the Lambo. Oh shit. It's got very nice brakes. You need good, good brakes. brakes. Good brakes are important if you're going 90 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. Well, obviously in a 90 mile an hour zone. Okay, we're not course. we're not speeding. No, we just might have gone to Mexico for a few of these clips. Dude, this is nice. How Chris has a Lambo? He works for the government. He can't he can't speak about it. Chris drove the GTR the other day. We were at the warehouse. And he's letting me drive his Gallardo. YOLO, we have a Lambo, guys. Everybody, back up, back up. Back All right, guys, come on. All right, here we go, here we go. I'm in the street now. There's a Lambo. There's a Lambo right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at this thing. Oh, I love the shifts. Yo, the shifts are so good. It literally throws you back in your seat. It does. Yo, this is a lot more fun than a Huracan. Really? I think so. This just feels more like a car built for the driver than a Huracan. Yeah. Because a Huracan. Okay, a Huracan just feels like a computer, like a straight up just like, it drives itself. Yeah, that's what I actually like about it. I like that the shifts are just so rough. Can't even imagine how much the twin turbo uh, I Lamborghini know, threw you back. That's so cool, it like literally pauses. You're right, it's like a manual transmission. Like literally, if you sit on a hill, it'll roll back. This is so fun, this is so much funner than I thought it'd be. We were definitely just going 25 in a 25 zone right there. Oh, 100% going 25 miles an hour right now. Yeah, it just needs a wrap now. It does. I think you know someone that does raps. I have raps. a whole new respect for Gyro. I do know people that do raps, yeah. I have a really big connection with a rap place. Really? We need to get this Gyro rap. Yeah, we do. We got the human races down there, the Yeezys. Yeah, boy. Always choosing cars. You like my Lamborghini? Thank you. <laughs> it's my dad's. All right, guys, so Chris is going to do a flyby for us in his Gyro. I'm going to stay here. He's going to go from there and round. Seriously, I have to say, I have never really been a fan of Gyro's just because of like Huracans, and I'm kind of a fanboy for cars. But uh, I am blown away. This thing was really fun to drive. Oh! God, I seriously have to say I have a new love for Gardos. I did not think I would ever like driving that car. Same with Corvettes. And then I drove a Corvette and, I, and like Corvettes are, they're good cars. They drive really well. And I'm not sitting here trying to act like I know a crap ton about Gardos and stuff. But from driving a Huracan to driving that, for someone who doesn't, oh, here he goes. He's a savage. He's a savage. Hey, um, yeah, do you, um, you're really cute. Thanks. Can I go on a date with you? You definitely can. Okay, I'm just gonna get in. I'm not a gold digger though, I swear. Promise? Wow, this is a nice car though. Thank you. How much money do you make? Oh wait, that just, I shouldn't ask that yet. Oh God. Savage, bro. Thank you so much for taking me on a ride in this. No problem. Okay, decisions, decisions. By the way, guys, don't mind him parking right here. This is just for this clip, and then we're gonna move it back there. So don't, don't, don't get your, don't get your tush all heated up and stuff. Which one's more fun? You answer first. You've driven both. You've driven Guaxilla and you've driven your Gallardo. Which one do you like more? Yours is more smooth and has more power. Yeah. This is just more like. It's purpose. more of a car. Yeah. It's it's, yeah. it's a bull. Yeah. It's a bull. I agree with him. My car obviously has more power and it's like way louder, but like. They're different cars. They're completely different cars, but I don't know, bro. I think we, have, we should probably trade. I think we should do a rev battle. We should do a rev battle. Trade, depending on who wins. Oh, is this a V10? Yeah. Oh, we should do a rev battle. I got the keys to my car. We're about to have a rev battle, and this entire neighborhood is probably going to hate us. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Smoke like that? Um, it's just because it, it's not completely. I told you the neighbors would be pissed. Yo, the real question is, is who won? I don't know. Honestly, not gonna lie. Who won? Probably Chris. <laughs> no, what? But yeah, my dude. pops. But yours just has like fire and smoke, which makes it like way cooler. But okay. Well, okay, that's the difference between a twin turbo V6 and a V10. Like, that's like a known fact. V10s are gonna sound like crispy and like way better. There's a good possibility that our cars are gonna get heat because the neighbors complained. Like I called out, wow, those, that, that was fun, guys. I did not have a vlog today and now I do. Oh. I know it did, and she was taking pictures of us. Was she really? The lady over there. Hey, it was worth it though, we got the footy. That was a fun past 10 minutes, bro. So much went on. This is just a baller garage, Chris. You're a savage. You just got your guy out of parking here. That was so fun, what the hell? Hey, ladies and gentlemen, we've officially found him. Don't vlog me vlogging you, boy. What I'm is this? I'm everybody. What are those? They're dirty. But is Jake looking at a ring? What is Jake doing? Jake is in the cut, bro. Hey, good to see you, man. 
Let's see. What are you guys doing? I'm getting Alyssa a necklace because we're doing like a thing where, where and I picked a. Anyways, they're yeah. filming. They're filming at the mall. Hey, don't get any ideas. Uh oh. Don't get any ideas. All right, if you guys don't know who Soul is, Soul is like a world champion. I, what are you? I don't know. What, what do you call yourself? I don't know. I just, I'm an urban He's a flipper. flipper. He is a like professional superhuman flipping god. And acrobatics. You're, be, yeah, sure acrobatics. Get ready for this, guys. Like that was just for fun. Oh, he's still he's still going. Okay, not bad, not bad. This man is insane. Oh, security. Woo! Security. It's the same gang. It's the same guy. Uh oh. There's so many cameras. Uh oh. We're just a bunch of cameras. We all got our thumbnails and titles, guys. Yo, Taylor, you ever been escorted out by a security guard at the mall? Look behind us. escorted out. Okay, so Sol did a few flips. I just got here. Apparently, they've been messed with with the same security guard. But I, I'm I'm new here. We're all vloggers. <laughs> we all are vloggers. <laughs> Everyone's all vlogging. vlogging. Everyone and has to. Vlog. Somehow we're getting escorted out of the mall by yeah, <laughs> for doing people. flips. Hey, what's your Instagram? You want a pop tag? You got one, bro. You're gonna blow up. All right, we're gonna leave now because we got here and apparently they've been doing flips all day and causing a lot of trouble. But we just got here. What's going I'm on being now? Followed, bro. We just got here. I don't I'm even know what's followed. going on. Okay, there's just another security guard back there behind us. I just got here and sold it a flip and then we got in trouble and now there's security guards following us and stuff. Guys, YouTubers can't go anywhere. People just hate us. Yeah, they literally People just hate us. We're but just there's a whole Davidson. Oh, sh being roasted by a security guard. Guys, I'm sorry if I sound obnoxious, but these security guards are following me for no reason. And I'm trying to leave, but they just keep coming up on my girl. Jake, get in the car. They're just pestering us now. I'm scared. You, this, guys, I hope you know this is because Sol did like five flips in the in the mall. From what I understand, hey, I don't know what they did before us. Watch out. One of them has a bicycle. Oh, God. All right, guys, I am back at my house now, which means this is the end of the video. Uh, there was a lot. This whole video was supposed to be something completely different, but hey, things don't work out. We made the most of it. We got kicked out of the mall, which was fun. That's that's always good. I drove a Gallardo, so today was awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to drop a thumbs up. Peace out. I will see you in tomorrow's vlog, and... Follow the outro. I wish you were so good.